Hello everyone, this is Serious Trivia. Welcome back to another episode of our Semi Legendary campaign. This is episode 32. We'll be picking it up from turn 156 in the summer season of 322. So last episode, we wiped out Semalun and Semajul and two other small factions, and we have started our war with Semayul. So to reach our ultimate victory, uh, if we look here, um, we have to wipe out the remaining uh, four princes here. Samawe is ready our vassal. We simply have to annex them. Um, we're going to save that for the end. These three we have to kill somehow. We are at war with Samayo. And the unfortunate part of ultimate victory here uh, is that we have to destroy these factions. And there's no way of them like abdicating the throne. Like in the base game. So we literally have to take every single territory and beat all their army to consider uh, victory. So it's going to be very slow and it's going to bog down our series here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be skipping a lot of the fights uh, that are less interesting uh, for fights yes. where we have legendary characters like Sima Yong or like Zhang Fang. We'll showcase those uh, fights where we're taking cities and stuff. We'll just be skipping through them. Uh, I'll set them up, fight them myself and then cut them out. Hopefully it won't affect our viewing experience and uh, we'll test it out and uh, see how it works out. Uh, we'll start out with this fight here. Uh, this is a fight we saved for ourselves from last episode. Um, we actually said we were going to just siege and end turn and let them come out to fight us during the end turn phase, which I think would happen. Uh, we finished up all our construction and we got all the stuff done. Last turn, I believe all the armies have moved. This one is defending, so they will hold still. We're basically keeping an eye on our vassal over here. I have a feeling they're going to rebel against us. And they can. this army can also act as an emergency force in case Sima Yue uh, enters a war with us. So let's continue. Let's end turn here. Yeah, like we expected, they came out to fight. Uh, this is wonderful. We're going to be fighting this and showing this off. Let's go. Let's kill Sima Yue. Alrighty, we loaded in. Uh, pretty flat map, which is nice. Weather is also nice. Um, they're coming from one direction. We can just set up over here and uh, wait for them to come towards us. Now, sadly, this is probably one of our worst armies. Uh, we have crossbowmen instead of uh, onyx dragons. And we still have these archer of Zin. Uh, we should probably give this army a better composition. But... We are in the heat of war, so there is no time for adjustments. These guys will just have to make do with what they have. I mean, it's not terrible. They still have Azor Dragons. They have these Cataphracts. And uh, the generals are okay. Not not the best. Uh, Sima Jian is pretty good. But the other generals, so so. I think it's Sunday. Yep. All right. So let's see if they will march towards us. They have Xianbei horse archers, quite strong unit, 200 range though. Not as good as the Tiang horse riders that Sima Ying has. Those have 250 range. Um, I don't think he's actually gonna come till he gathers up his reinforcement. So we're gonna cut this part out and we'll cut it back to when they get into range. So see y'all then. All right, guys, we're back. They're charging at us. Um, they didn't really wait for their reinforcement though. They don't have any real crossbow unit. They only have these heavy repeater crossbow, which only has a hundred range. So we can really just ignore that. Uh, we want to be hitting these pearl dragons though. They are quite strong. Alright, everyone just hold their ground. Alright, we'll be okay. Let's see if we can get a duel off. Um, we'll have Sima Jian take this duel. There we go. Smile doesn't want to duel us, that's fine. We have put our cavalry into these diamond formation. We're going to be sending them to counter charge their enemy cavalry. And then we're going to use our front line to just hold on here. We should be totally okay. 
I'm gonna march our general out like this. Actually, I'm just focus on these cavalry. Oh, he's suiciding into us. It's a roar, but it's not gonna do much against us. Alright, their front line's not really coming out here to attack us. They are trying to chase our cavalry. Which is kind of smart. But also, we're not going to let them. We're going to just pull most of them across our line. Alright, here they come. Attack back. Switch to blade. Fight. There we go. Uh, we got stuck here. I wanted to go kill this strategist. We should be able to win this duel. It's close. It's closer than we want. How come he's so strong? We have gold item. He has bronze. Oh, we got him. Alright, we got him a nice choke. And we're, we're going after their strategist in the back. Alright. Get a small heal off that. Alright, we can take them on separately. We'll come give them, reduce their armor. Perfect. What about our cavalry? Have we not killed Sima Yong yet? This is awfully a long time to not kill a general. Alright, they can hunt down this general together. Alright, maybe they can go kill these cavalry. Alright, they wiped out Samayo. There we go. He's running away. We'll have Sima Jian chase him down. We don't need to chase this group. It's going to be too hard to catch the horse archers. We're just going to be charging at these units. Where's our other... Okay, they went up too far. Come back. Alright, we'll pull everyone back. And prepare for the second group. How are they not winning here? We'll come give them a morale roar. These guys have really high morale. Very sh surprised. Alright. Have them go back to shooting arrows. Have our cavalry charging at these archers. Come on, we can catch him. She recovered, actually. Should go catch her. We're really having trouble with these. Charge. Not that she will be actually helpful. They're useless now. Alright, that cavalry just suicided into us. Alright, let's pull these guys out. Alright, they're all routing. It's over. Alright. Let's see if we can catch him. We can't. We're very tired. Um, this is a garrison fight. So we'll still have another chance to fight them inside the city. So we're actually going to chase. Um, I'll cut it till the end. So see y'all then. Alright, we try to chase down as many as we can. And uh, there's 83 left. Smayo and the generals are all still alive. This one got full healed because we killed him on the battlefield. Uh, we captured the strategist. Uh, modest, dutiful, composed. It's actually quite good traits. Um, I think... I think we're going to actually execute. I will get replenish. We lost good chunk of man as well. Alright, like expected, our vassal uh, declared their independence. Good thing we have army nearby just to keep an eye on them. 
All right, Sima Yong signed a peace treaty with Sima Yue. This is not a good development. And he has formed. Oh, that's fine. We're at war with both of them. All right, our vassal betrayed us. Ooh, okay. Our daughter has another daughter, granddaughter for us. And we picked up our final military reform. So now we can work on espionage. We're going to start with this one right here because this one provides diplomatic relationship with all other factions. Out of every single diplomat, uh, uh, these are what? Reforms? This is my favorite one. Probably the only one I would consider taking before these. So let's pick that up. Um... Our spy got promoted to government. That's great. We gained Confucius Sage. Pretty okay item. Not that good. Um, ambush outside of Don't. Interesting. Some characters. Doesn't look like anyone have good armor. Just a quick look through their traits. See if anyone has good traits. Oh, she's 68 even if she has good traits. Oh, these are really old characters. She's 30. Used to work for our. Used to work for our um, vassal, but not anymore. Yeah, our grandchildrens are, the ranks of our grandchildren is filling out pretty nicely. Uh, we didn't really do a great job marrying off his kids. There's quite a few old single guys. Maybe we can just yeah. Maybe we'll take her. She could be a spy, but her faction is going to be destroyed very soon, so it doesn't really matter. All right, let's marry him with her. Perfect. Relative the same age, 32, 30. Uh, he's 25. He can wait a bit. 24, 23. Wow, he has a lot of kids. And uh, he has this daughter about to come of age and these two new kids with a new wife. He's 50. He's 50, guys. His wife is 45. I don't know how this kid... I mean, it's not menstrual cycle yet, but, but still. Alright, so these things all worked out. Um, we'll continue and we'll wrap up this fight against Sima Yong. Uh, he's actually going to be on the battlefield, so we will fight this on the battlefield. He also has reinforcement coming, so we should do this pretty fast. Oh, they're in range. That is surprising. I mean, we can do night battle and get rid of this situation. Yeah. Now this is just hilarious. All right, let's fight. Alrighty. Uh, this is probably a very boring fight. We'll probably cut most of this, at least the parts where we are sieging. Um, basically, they are going to be dying off to us. There's 80 guys in there. All right, let's let's start shooting at him. Let's burn him down. Where are you gonna run? Remember the opening trailer where Sima Yun was shooting flaming shots at us when we're in the city. Well, now it's the opposite. Oh, he's bravely riding towards us. Oh God. There he goes. That was satisfying. Alright, they still have one strategist. We're gonna just have everyone shoot at him. He's also called Sima Jian. It's probably a different Jian. Same name as our general. So vastly different fate. Uh, he has 15 morale. Once he gets injured, he's probably gonna run. Alright, it's going pretty slowly, but... I mean, it's quite brave to be able to stand here and take this. Alright, that's it. That's the end. We don't have to actually shoot him all the way. We just had to shoot him all the way. I mean, he got crushed by his horse. Didn't really burn. Sima Jun's death was much more satisfying. Alright, we got them. He's probably going to go back to court, and then we have to find him again on the battlefield. But in case we don't, that was a satisfying end for him. 
Let's see, what do they have built here? Fishing port, great. Okay, state workshop, private workshop. Okay, land development, all good stuff. Uh, once they repair, we can build our own buildings. Uh, this army is stuck in our territory. He's got to try to get back to his territory. Uh, we're going to cut them off. We'll be taking Pingyuan. Uh, so we're going to siege here. They have tribuches inside. Wait till they come out. But we're probably not going to show this fight even if they do come out. It's a lot of men, but the solution is quite simple. And as far as I can see, Zhang Fang is not here. So we'll let them come out during the end turn and wipe them out. Smai is pretty much healed. Uh, there's no one here. So we can take the fishing port for ourselves, actually. We'll just simply automate this fight. There we go. Right, get us some more food here. They have the right one, but yeah, they have the right one. Level up on Smaku. Uh, we'll be giving him over here. We're just going to go down the top over here. That's going pretty well. Somehow we can take the small regional city if he wants. Um, our army in Taiyuan. Um, we could go farther north, but we can let Sma'ai do that. Sma'ai can actually round up this way. Uh, we're going to go back down, get a mission complete, move a unit into Taiyuan. There we go. And we're going to go down this way, because there's armies attacking us this way. i got to get ready over here. Uh, we'll get there in two turns. They're not really healthy, so it should be fine. Huang Xing? Okay, so this is the faction we destroyed down south. We have his daughter. Maybe we should remind him of that. Alright, so this army, we're redeploying them back over here. Back on defense duty. Once we start attacking Sima Yue, they're going to be the one crossing the river this way and preventing them from attacking us. Alright, we put them here for just the reason if they rebel against us, and they did, so they're asking for their doom. Um, we can't automate this. We'll siege and let them come out. There's no rush with this army. See what they do. Our vassal here should help us, so that should also be pretty easy. There's a couple options to dealing with this army here. Uh, we can't negotiate peace with them because we're in a war with Smayu. Okay, so I guess diplomacy is out of the option here. We have to just attack them. I mean, if we put this army here, what are they going to do? Right, they're, they're, they're in a boat right now. We don't want to fight a navy, naval battle. We'll let them siege us and then we'll come out and wipe them. That's how this will play out. Um, all our army has moved. We're waiting for them to basically come out and fight us. We're, but we're waiting for them to attack us. All right, I think we're good. Let's move on to next turn. All right, they're coming out to fight us. The siege over here. Somehow they created another army. Oh, they recruited a new army, okay. They have a lot of men. We're out number four to one. But I think we can beat them. All right, there's not any significant generals on the field, but I feel like this is a battle we should show just because of the sheer number of the enemy. Let's see if it's interesting. All right, we loaded up in here. Uh, it's bad that it's fogging, but it's pretty good that the reinforcements all coming from behind there. So we can pretty much set up our army in one place. I think there is an advantage in spreading it out wide here. Because we don't have a front line, so we don't want the contact point to be small. We want them to have struggle coming towards us.
All right, going pretty much all in on fire. We have to put our cavalry half half for counter charging purposes. Uh, try to get a duel with Samapu. And the two strategies can stay in the back. All right, wish us luck. I'll cut it to whenever they approach us. All right, guys, here comes the enemy. Uh, we're holding back auto fire because there's only one raider cavalry in range. There's only one general who wants to duel. This guy right here, level six. Pretty impressive, but we don't want to duel right up here close to their army. All right, once mo more of their units come in to range, especially these ones, we'll start firing at will. Right, let's get one volley off against the cavalry. All right, horsey, let's see how you do against fire rocks. Pretty well, consider we miss most of you. All right, we're back over here. Any chance we hit more of you guys this time? Okay, much better hit. All right, switch over to these guys. Who I think you guys would do much better against. We'll let the cavalry charge. We'll counter charge them with this group right here. Okay, actually, why don't you guys just fire well? You guys are moving really weird as I aim at one unit. Well, that's good damage. These guys can pull this way. We can maybe pull some units to go across. Uh, General's approaching. We should take a duel now. This guy is approaching us. Okay, let's do this. Counterattack with our cavalry against their generals. So they don't mess up our front line. Do not run away because the general come. Alright, go sword mode. Stop the general. Charge at the archers. Alright, we just basically gotta keep the general away. Hopefully kill them, maybe even better. Their cavalry is not coming yet. They just sent the general out. This might be a bad fight for them. Actually, we should pull back. We need them over here in case the generals break through. Here, let's go up and help. Wow, well, we're getting, getting destroyed here. They're drawing us in. We need to preserve our cavalry. Go here and minimize everyone's armor. And then pull back real quick. Also give them a little bit of range block. Do some more damage with splash damage. Pull back. Go back to shooting. Yeah, we definitely need these cavalry in the front. Good. Alright, let's charge them. We should be able to hold here for a little bit. If we send him over... There we go, we killed that general. We're losing too much cavalry for no reason, basically. That's the problem. Alright, we can reduce their armor. There we go. We gotta overwhelm this group right here, and then we'll be fine. Oh, oh no 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 no! That's not good. How do these pearl dragons get so close? All right, come back, come back and help. Crush the pearl dragons. Oh, these are true spearmen. Never mind, they're not pearl dragons. These are pearl dragons. These are pearl okay. Good. They're routing. Their morale can't hold on. Come on. Do we have any ability we can use? Good, good. Just gotta hold them off enough. Alright, arrow block. Alright, 
Where's this art? Where's this guy? Alright, we got a group that made it behind. That's not good. The good news is they all have really low morale. The bad news is they're basically at our range line, which is really bad. Well, they're just throwing units at us now. They can't actually use these units to fight. Like, these are just archers without weapons. Alright, almost have ability usage. There we go. This one almost has ability usage as well. Alright, our archers can hold. Onyx Dragon can hold their ground. Our cavalry, though, is having trouble with all these spear units being thrown at us. That unit got wiped. Alright, reduce armor. Let's pull through. Actually, it's probably better if we just charge behind and get out and then charge back again. Let's try to kill these guys. Two seconds for ability usage. Alright, these cavalries charge out. Charge at these guys. These guys are breaking. Just gotta be careful with our strategists. They don't have much health. So we don't want to get them caught in bad places. Our, our archers are backfiring. Right? No? Start firing, guys. Yeah, there we go. We're stuck on melee, I think. Alright, let's get these archers. Actually, we should help our, our archers to get killed over here. They're still firing. Just this group right here is not. Come on. Reduce armor. If we just get through this group here, these archers are not a problem. Alright, we'll try to kill the general. Oh no, we're wavering. Oh, these guys got charged. We might lose this. Mm, not having a front line is a problem. Come on, we just gotta route them before they route us. Oh no. Alright, that was a tough fight. Smiting is in trouble. Alright, we routed. Alright, that was tough. They had too many men, and we didn't have a good enough front line. So that was bad. Alright, so they are attacking the port. Uh, we just need to delegate this simple fight. Alright. Got a horse. Not bad. A uh, 31 year old. We can't use her, and we, there's no point. We'll just release her. Get replenishment. Mm, Daiwan wants peace. We don't want to give it to them. We'll wipe them out. All right, we have our daughter give birth to another daughter, another granddaughter. And Sima Ying's daughter came of age. We will side with Ba Pun, our son-in-law. We got a rare talent. Let's see how good the rare talent is. All right, we have a setback. Sima Ying's army got wiped. 40-year-old, capable of spying. Defiant, determined, not bad. Let's send her out to spy once we get another spying position open. Um, she should try to pursue government jobs. And Zhang Lu actually got a government job. Or at least they said he did. Hmm. I got that notification, but it doesn't seem like it. All right, got a gray stallion. Ooh, 
We got Black Elite. Smiling, smiling. Where are you? I know you guys just had a tough fight. It was not pretty. But wait, oh, we lost the horse. Ah, uh, seized. Okay, sorry. We lost it in this fight. Ah, uh, that sucks. Hmm. We need to rest up here. I don't think they're capable of counter-striking us, so we'll just rest up and get replenished. Sima Shuo can come help in the meantime. This is a very simple delegate. There we go. That wiped out Sima Rei. We captured him. He has items. Ah, er, yeah, it's a dictionary book. And silver armor, so double execute. Replenishment. Uh, we finished off. Well, they, well, they're gonna get destroyed right after. Yep, there we go. All right, reinforcement is on the way. We'll be there soon. All right, one more turn, and we'll get there. So hang on tight. So my eyes, army. They're sieging it already, so there's no point for us to siege that. But we're going to go north and attack Yemen over here. We'll just go on regular. It's not going to be much faster. Alright. They send an army here. They have army here. Alright, they're going to be go face off with these guys over here. They need to get to Puyang. Sima Jian. Hmm, we could attack this right now. That's actually probably the best move. There's this army here. But I don't think they're capable of enough taking don't. I mean, I guess they could. <laughs> we don't really have much of a garrison here. Hmm. We'll worry about that soon. All right, another mission complete. That's great. We're going to go to a uh, regional city. And go government support. In building. Spice port. Corruption reduction. Tea house. More food production because our money situation's all set. All right, perfect. Now we just gotta do our two assignments. Mm, we'll let the level one girl go. Chang Wu is good. Zhang Ke. Do we have any level 1 characters that's happy there? There we go. Our niece. Um, I think that's everything for buildings. I don't think we should just go back for this army. If we lose it, we can always send this army back over later after they finish off here. I think we should just go north right now. We're ready here. Alright, they ran once. So now if we chase and finish them off, they're done. And we can just automate this fight. Save us some time. There we go. Since they ran once, it's all wiped anyways. Uh, we're gonna be executing going forward. I think it will actually make Samawe like us more because we're basically killing our enemies. Um, these are fine. These two can team up. 
and start pushing this way. Save the top end for Sima Ai, and then they can all loop back afterwards. Uh, maybe we shouldn't stay in the city. We need to stay next to our reinforcements, safer this way to get replenishment. If we stay here and get attacked, we get wiped. Mm, I believe 30 is the right number because we just picked up a new commander in Hlene. I just gotta double check to make sure I don't have to check these again afterward. Because I think the two we added are Hlene and Xi He. Okay, Hledong needs repairs. Interesting. Did we not repair these from earlier? Jiangling could get another building, actually. Oh, actually, state workshop for corruption reduction. Yep. Much needed. See? Much better. Do we need one here? Not really. They already have one. If we build anything, it'd be a marketplace. Ooh. We didn't fix Jian yet after the siege. Uh, this one need an upgrade. State workshop as well. Yeah, they're on the ocean, so... I don't think adjacency works very well for them. I don't actually know what the game considered adjacent to Ejo Island. Alright, so the new number is 27. That's the one we don't have to worry about. Let's end turn and uh, we'll pick up our fights afterwards. They're sieging, I believe. Yeah, nothing to do here. We need to wait at least two more turns here. So let's continue. Alright, Dai Wang. They send an army to fight us. This is our spies army, actually. Uh, they picked a night battle. We could refuse and just retreat and then make them chase us, but there's no point. Let's just fight. Um, they have one trebuchet, but not much cavalry. Our army's not the greatest, but we should be able to handle this. Alrighty. Nice open plain. Um, they have a trebuchet as well. So we'll pull some distance first. This is one of our not so advanced armies. No onyx dragons here. A lot of them are still injured. Ooh, very injured actually. This might be a tough fight. But at least we have a front line. It's unlike the other battle. Can pull our calves to one side, generals to the other side. It's foggy, so it's good. I'm gonna send our general out to see if we can get a duel off. Um, let's see if we can find them first. Not super healthy. We should avoid duels with the uh, sentinels. She doesn't want to duel us. I mean, she has a good shot. Alright, at least we got sight on their cavalry. I want sight on their trebuchet. Zhang Fu wants to fight us. He's our spy. Poorly equipped. Alright, if their cavalry catches us, we'll fight. Or else I kind of want to try to find the trebuchet first. Alright, fine, fine, fine. We'll take the duel. We found it, but we can't get to it. Maybe after a duel. Did we accidentally burn him a little? Alright, cavalry stay close so I can splash damage. Let's go. Alright, their trebuchets are so close. Let's beat our spy in the duel so we can go fight them. Hmm, they put their cavalry against our cavalry on this side, which is interesting. Let's shoot first. Pull this side. Gotta kill these pearl dragons. Too strong. 
I don't know if we're winning this duel. Doesn't seem like we are. All that gold armor can't win a duel? Come on. They have Onyx Dragons. That's just great. Alright. At least we can get to the Tribuchet. They can't stop us from doing that. Alright, it's time to... Oh, we beat them! Impressive. Alright, you kill Johnny's Dragons, you kill Tribuchets. You're closer. Just have to get on your horse. And then this is a free kill. There we go. Nice. Right. Their units are charging forth. We're wiping out their cavalry with our cavalry. We can wipe out their general too. Right, this is a much, much more manageable fight. Kill this general. Ooh, their tribuchets are hitting us pretty hard. Come on, let's wipe them out. Let's kill this general. She's routing. Is she gonna die? 400 health, there we go. There we go. Nice charge on spear on the sword units. Alright, that's a wipe. Alright, we got this. Alright, Tribuchet's losing. Just don't get engaged on by the... Pearl Dragon unit. Alright, they're all routing. We won. We're gonna chase a little bit. Just to kill off some of these uh, range units, and then we'll end our fight. All right, that was a good fight. The difference a small front line makes. Uh, we captured all three. Uh, we can extract our spy, but we could just release him. Um, let's release him. Since these two people witness that he's our spy, we should kill them. I'm joking, but uh, we could hire this one. This one's pretty interesting. Good stats. Decent age. She's also decent. Let's recruit both of these. Get replenishment to help keep our spies cover. Oh no. Wait, who is this? Died of old age? Hmm, can't really tell by the armor. But I'll, I'll see soon enough. We'll put Samayo out there. He's 70. Uh, might as well let him see some action before he dies off. Yeah, we have plenty of young men, but we'll put the 70 guy out there for fun. Got an armor. Yeah, died of natural causes. Tai Chen. Okay, 65 only. Gained a robe. Uh, we do need to give Sima Yao some items. Can't have him going out there fighting with no items. It's the dead guy's items, I know, but he gets a new horse. Um, this is pretty good. All right, we'll go this way. All right, this one's still sieging. Oh, she leveled up. Uh, what army is she in? Let's find her in the army. Right here. So she's not leading the army. There's no point to get this one. Might as well get Guile then. Who else leveled up? Someone in court? Alright, perfect. Alright, these younger generals are waiting their turn for older generals to die off. Alright, 
Maybe Sima Wei can take care of them up here, and we can just keep going filtering this way. I kind of don't want to go all this way up and then come down. Eh, but we might have to, so let's just go. Sima Wei can take care of this. Um, let's see, they're just trying to get into position. This army needs a lot of rest. So they can go back, take a break. They will stay close for now. And then we'll try to take this over. They're sending armies out to attack us, actually. Which is interesting. We can reach this guy, I think. That's the oh that's that's the leader himself. The spy we released. I want the Taiyuan higher mine and grab it this turn. This is the auto resolve right here. Uh, we don't have night battle, but we just delegate this. Alright, nice and easy. We got a level up here as well. Ah, smile. Just came out and got a level. Great. Uh, give your spear unit some armor. There we go. Hmm, they're not leveling up their buildings. There we go. Now this group, they push up here. They push out here. We need to come back and reinforce. I don't know if we can catch them. It looks like we can. But I might want to just reinforce here. Alright, if we go march, we can just reinforce here. Which is probably the best move, I think. Alright, a couple armies coming down. Is that Zhang Feng? Nope. Where is Zhang Feng? That's my question. We don't see him. Alright, they're still sieging. At the end of the turn, they'll come out and fight us. Alright, 28. What did we gain? We didn't gain anything, so why is it 28 now? Nothing really changed. I guess the new number is just 28. Okay, alright. Uh, we can actually just continue. Uh, let's go another turn. Alright, not wanting to take attrition, they came out to fight us. We have a guaranteed victory. I'm just not going to fight it. I'll take heavy losses. It's okay. We'll just delegate this. Alright, not too bad. We'll get replenishment. Alright. He died. He was just outside, maybe of old age. And we have another son born. This time to a son. No, Sima Ying has another. Wow, he's had another kid. Wow. Okay, so we could lose some noble support, gain some spying, gain some mind. Our mind is over as level 5 as well. So maybe we just arrest him and get might at this point. Our wealth is almost there. Let's arrest him. All right, let's see. They pulled their army away. Smyon was doing something, I don't know, really weird. Smyon's back on the map. We could just fight him again. That's actually the most exciting thing we can do. But first, let's take some of these territory for free. He's just sailing around, not really defending. All right. We'll night battle this. I'll just delegate. Not not that heavy of a loss. The generals got white pretty hard, but it's fine. Alright. Let's see. How do they build this? Pretty poorly.
Not sure why they have this building though. I guess some some food. It's not terrible. We can go to regional city here. Uh, government support and probably marketplace. Wrong one, wrong one. Marketplace. And then we'll go food production. There we go. Done with this commandery. We'll march up and fight Samayu. Uh, if we fight the fish king port, he'll come in as reinforcement. That drag him into the fight. Uh, we'll fight this. Uh, kill him again. Is he injured still? No, he's got his resiliency back, so we can't wipe him, but we'll be able to burn him again. So, oh, no, we want to fight him. So let's jump in here. Alright, guys. Uh, we loaded up into the fight. Uh, this is the city. This is the port we have to take. And this is our welcome party for Samayun's reinforcement army. Uh, let's jump in here and watch him die. Where are you gonna come up? Uh, not right away. Oh man. Charge. Yeah, they get some return fire on us, but come on, this is epic. This is how you stuff out a reinforcement army. The trebuchet is very useless here, but the archers are very useful. Uh, we could do more damage with uh, not fire archers, but nope, not fighting you just yet. You are very strong. We respect that. All right, let's pull them out. Keep pulling, keep pulling. Use our speed. Now he is strong, but now is a good time. Let's watch our son wipe out Samayu over here. The rest of these will just use our chibiches and archers to kill. Knocked us off our horse. Go deep off his armor for Samashu. That's a lot of fire. There we go. Alright, debuff. He, th he still has his gold armor, but he doesn't have his gold weapon anymore. He took our horse from Samayin. He has it. We want it back. Alright, we got him. That debuff on the armor really helps. There we go. Beautiful. Oh god. Okay. Charge back. The people has come out of the city to help. It's okay. We have our yellow dragons just for this. Let's loop out. Charge, charge. Alright, there we go. What? Our strategist? Oh. Oh, wow. We just had her stand there. That's unfortunate. Uh, we should probably pull him back to... Actually, I don't know. Against five pearl dragons? Not sure we can win that. Might as well not risk it. You can go kill the five pro dragons. Oh, they routed. Then get, go, go, get back on your horse. Uh, he's gone crazy. Alright, we got this. Actually, we're killing our old man here. We can just use our cavalry and our infantry to win this. Yeah, it's over. 
Just crush this unit and it's over. Hmm, we lost our strategy. Kind of bummed about that. Why is this unit not routing? It's negative 100. Yeah, there we go. Alright, we won. Alrighty, we got to kill him again. He's gonna go back to court. He's gonna summon him again. And I'm gonna kill him again. Um, it'd be pretty funny, actually. Let's occupy. Very proud of our son. Beat him in a duel. That was not easy. She has resiliency. That's good. But she needs a turn to come back. Uh, we got to level up here. He has both of the good skills. Um, get some attack rate on himself. We don't have oh we don't have reach okay that's very important um this army has healed up quite a bit we can just group these two armies together and they'll actually be both safer for it i think we made pretty good progress who else is leveled up uh, down here We'll do assignments for her. Smart Eyes Army. We can probably pick this up with a delegate fight. No army, please. Okay. We'll delegate this fight. Uh, night battle on. Delegate. Alright, let's fix up how this is built. Go with corruption reduction, max that out, max out farming, that's good, that's good. That's not supposed to be here. Yeah, let's go with the end building instead. And then we can go tea house max. And then upgrade this one more time marketplace actually the labor does make some sense because this is a peasantry place but still going to focus on the commerce and uh, industry side of things and just provide food for the money all right this is easy we'll just take this um there's an army defending here but this one seems to be wide open so we're actually going to delegate this fight here. We'll activate it. Play lose about 100 something men. 200? Hmm. A little bit more than I thought. Not a big difference. Gotta switch this to more money, less food. We're doing good on food. Um, Let's see where else. We have Smaue coming out to help us. There's one territory here. They're just marching. We're almost there. We can actually go on march and just get there this turn. Don't have to worry about them anymore. This army delegated the fight. Now we have our vassal here to help us. We can just delegate this. And our vassal is no more over here. Uh, we caught a general. We'll just execute her, I guess. Yeah, she's rivals with our daughter. Execute. Occupy. Alright, our vassal is no more. We could give this over to our other vassal to make them like us more. Because they have this piece anyways. Uh, but not not necessary. Not necessary right away at least. We can definitely use the replenishment. Uh, move them a little bit this way and then give them over later. Um, that wraps up our turn actually. And uh, pretty much our episode. Uh, we'll end our episode here. We'll come back next time. We are making our final push in the north. They don't have much land left. We'll be able to wrap up the North fight next episode, and then we can turn our attention to Sima Yue down in the Central Plain 
and Samaju will be pretty easy as well. So we're almost there, maybe three more episodes I think. And then we can be done with this one and move on to our next Let's Play. I'm thinking about playing Ma Teng and go very military heavy, but we'll see about that. Um, so see y'all next time. Bye!